Hey guys, and welcome back to another Suspicious Link video with me. Uh, thank you to everyone who is sending them through to me. I really appreciate it. Um, and sorry if I'm not responding to every single comment. I'm doing my best, but they're coming in quite heavily now. Um, so I'll do my best to always respond. So keep sending through comments. I will do my absolute. Um, and for those people who are still sending me links, keep sending them because I will inevitably get to them. I'm thinking uh, at some point in the near future, I'm just going to do a bulk um, record and edit session uh, to just try and get through the list a little bit quicker. So I'm getting to up to, to more up-to-date stuff. So um, jumping into this one, we are looking at one that was sent to me and that is uh, bed.limo. I was going to say it wasn't going to give me any nudity. Yes. They look fake. They look fake. Yes. Yes. Who's going to drive a car naked? Wow. I don't think it's supposed to look like that. Mind you to see someone. I guess the running theme for this for these links is they are becoming increasing increasingly more graphic. Um Yeah. They're, they're, yeah, they're becoming a lot more graphic than what they used to be. If you see like say the first ones I did like vom.in.net or something like that uh it's quite mild like it's the toon stuff so it starts off with like the, the anime or cartoony sort of splash page and then might switch to the dirty tinder and then takes you to some bogus dating site but all the women are clothed and that sort of stuff um this one just it's just straight up off the bat the splash page might be like moving um nudity which just switches into something that just holds multiple images. Doesn't matter. Whoa. Oh, I mean, then they're not. Sh oh, they're not shy. Thank goodness. All my stuff is like pre-saved in here. I, I, I couldn't do this without having it all pre-saved. Good thing it's, um, yeah, all done in a virtual machine. So for anybody who's like maybe nervous or anything like that as to what it is I'm doing, just throwing my the, the email address out there. It is just a, a bogus email address that I set up for this one purpose. So I won't be using this email address for anything else other than this. Um, I recognize the web page. Upload a photo, make a good first impression. So we'll upload a photo. I've got one saved. Done. Okay, so. I imagine that we're just going to be after the, yeah, the upgrade. Renews at $99.95 every six months. $100 US every six months. Be pricey. I mean, I haven't been on like a dating site or anything like that for a very long time. And you don't typically have that much luck in them anyway um more messages more messages okay so let's let's go back yep so let's just find someone that's not showing what they had for breakfast 
All right, you're showing what you had for breakfast. Um, something mild. There we go. You, there, that's that's mild enough that I don't need to edit that out. That you can you can see everything I'm seeing. Uh, write your message. Um, how much do you? Love Super Smash Bros on the sixty four. Oh, this person's online. How many credits do I get? This is hi there. Thanks for your message. Are you really from Perth? Nope. VPN. Ma. Ba. <laughs> so for those who for those who aren't able to see the text that's coming in um it just says are you really from perth yes i am um wow well, just back off for a second uh thanks for your message are you really from perth i said nope vpn my bar my bars don't worry about it slang uh Nice, usually guys far away messaging me. Uh, she likes my profile picture. Thinks I look really handsome. Um, I'm here to find someone for casual fun. And you look to be a suitable candidate for this. Suitable. It's a misspell suitable. What about you? Still around? Impatient much? Nah. Blocked. You used up your free chats. Please upgrade your account to continue chatting. So you're speaking to a bot when you jump into this and you start talking to anybody. It's instantly a bot. Like, um, it is close to 11 PM. So it's saying that this person here is in Perth, um, close to about 11 PM here at the moment. Uh, yeah, the, ignore this time. I don't give this computer any power to do anything. And most people have work tomorrow. Why would you be online on this? And responding that quickly. To a goat. So, this here is 100% fake. Don't fall for it. Don't get this far. And... Uh, yeah, just keep your eye out for these sorts of links. So that's probably going to do it for this episode, everyone. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, if, you keep, if you keep seeing these sorts of new links, send them through to me. I will get to them, promise. Uh, and keep sending through the comments because I will try to respond to every single one or as many as I can. So yeah, till the next episode, everyone. Stay safe. Peace.